So I've tried this before, the whole daily vlogging thing, and it really hasn't worked out just because I never really find time to, to do it, to edit it, but I just hired an outsourced editing team which will help me pump, pump out way more content, which I'm excited about. To give you kind of a backstory about why I'm doing this is I'm starting another business. So I know I haven't really been on YouTube too much, but I currently run my own videography company called Blank Slate Media. We do video videography for events, branding, all that stuff. But I'm starting another company pretty soon and I wanted to take you guys from literally day one of what that looks like, what the process is, and everything that goes into it. So it is day two of just this daily documentation of what it looks like building an actual business. I'm here at Stone Creek 88.9 uh, coffee shop in Milwaukee. I just had a meeting with Q, Quentin alums if you don't know him. LinkedIn powerhouse, personal brand expert. Uh, I know he doesn't like the word expert. I don't like the word expert, but he knows his stuff. I uh, just really met about a group we're, we're uh, building and just future goals, what we've been up to. So he's just helped me a bunch as far as the personal branding side of things. He is the one who actually got me on LinkedIn on, in the first place. Um, so it's, it's good to catch up with him. I think we'll probably catch up um, every week here. But yeah, just super, super good meeting and just absolutely, absolutely loved it. Another thing I've been doing is reading Building a Story Brand. This book is literally one of the best books I have in my life. So I would, I can't recommend it enough. Luke Marlowe put me onto it uh, by Donald Miller. So amazing, amazing, amazing book. So plan of action today is, I just had the meeting with Q, obviously. I'm gonna read Building a Story Brand a little bit. I'm gonna finish the book. Uh, I only have about 30 pages left. And then I have a call with uh, my silent partner that I am starting this whole company with. So back to back to back things. And then after that, I'm going back to the office to just do a little more client work, see what Tyler's uh, doing. Maybe get a few lights for the office, redo that a little bit, but until then, reading the book and then have a, have a call with the partner to just talk more business stuff. So I'll take you guys with and record that as well. So I just got done uh, with a phone call for like two hours with my partner for Snack Size and super excited for the direction of the company and to announce more changes I'm making. So really now it's just meeting with the team, with the Blank Slate team, balancing the two out, balancing Blank Slate and balancing Snack Size. and how they'll not compete with each other, but just work together and balance each other and complement each other. So basically the main difference between Blank Slate Media and Snack Size Media is Blank Slate Media will be um, very, very polished videos, very like way higher end, high production videos um, and that more storytelling aspects of things and really just more of a videography production company. And then Snack Size is on the complete opposite end of the spectrum. That's the, that's the short form social media videos at scale, uh, targeting small businesses, which we can do because on our end, if we build up a huge video library, it, it only costs us two, three dollars to make each video, but if we sell it for 15 to 20 dollars per video, then that's where the real scale comes in. So I'm super excited to implement all of all of those changes um, and really just build the company from scratch again. So again, super excited. I'm gonna take you guys through the journey of all of this, what it's like building an actual company and documenting from literally day one. But I'm walking to the office right now because I live only like, it's like a three minute walk from my house to the office, but I think it's going to rain pretty soon here. Uh, hopefully it doesn't by the time I get to the office. But I have an event at 5.30 today. It's gonna be a Startup Milwaukee event. So our company, Blank Slate Media, is actually sponsoring that event. So I'm super excited to go to that. I'm gonna, I'm gonna vlog there, run into a bunch of people. Tyler will be handling the actual video production for that event and pictures. I'm gonna vlog around, meet people, network, do my thing. So that is tonight, excited to take you guys with. Uh, but until then, I'm just going to the office right now to, uh, to really have that meeting with Tyler and just see, um, see the dynamics and talk to him about how everything will balance out between Blank Slate and Snack Size. So I really didn't think this one through, walked to the office, 
but I uh, have to carry some uh, little light video gear on the way home to get my car to drive to the event. Oh well, a little walk doesn't hurt anyone. At least it's not a bunch of gear, it's just a backpack and a stabilizer. I'm on my way to the Star Milwaukee event to film it. Actually, Tyler's gonna film it, I'm gonna vlog it and meet a lot of my friends there, my business related friends. So I'm gonna take you guys with and it uh, should be a great event. It's at uh, Zocolo Food Truck Park, I believe that's how it's pronounced. So first time there, heard the owner's pretty cool, heard the whole park is cool. So I can't wait to show you guys. Run, run, run. <laughs> Made it. Are you famous on TikTok? I am. So we made it to the startup event. It happens, it starts at like 5.30 or something. It's around five, waiting for people to come in. Super excited about this. A lot of uh, local Milwaukeeans will show up, uh, show out. So excited to bring you guys with me. Already ran into J-Matt from, uh, from TikTok, but no, from Kiss FM. So he's a homie. We'll, we'll link up later and take you guys with. What's up, dude? Good to see you again. This is where the party is. How's it going? Good, sir. I'm Sam. Tommy. Tommy, how's it going? We out here, Tech Bash. Alec, what do you do besides be a badass? Uh, I work for Marquette University. We run the student run business program where we put students in charge of startups. My man. I'm Sabrina, I'm a student at MSOE, and I just like bull around Milwaukee about most of the time. That's, that. That's the gist. Quality! <laughs> I'm gonna run after Chandler. You wanna come with? Yep. I'm taking him down. Look at this, dude! <laughs> What's up, dude? How's how you doing, my man? Good to see you. Dude, how's it going? Hi, how are you? Good. Hey, I'm Sam. Hi, Natasha. So the event has been going well. It is currently 7.15, sun is setting a little bit, so before, uh, lighting was super, super harsh on the actual event, but now we're gonna go film some more. Well, Tyler's gonna film some more, I'm gonna keep vlogging. But you can see in the background, there's a bunch of people. Um, so super, super well-organized event. There's a bunch of people, there's, uh, I guess like 600 some signed up, but the place can only fit like three to 400. So interesting dynamic. Obviously all 600 didn't show up. Um, but yeah, event goes until I think 8.30 or 9.30. So kind of just hanging around and... <laughs> My man, um, I'll go, uh, go over there, meet some people, dab up with some people and I uh, bring you guys with. So that's what we're doing now. I'm doing so good, man. Yeah, man. How are you doing? I'm doing good. Oh, are you vlogging right now? Oh, how's it going, vlog? This is weird. Usually, I do the vlogging. I'm not used to being vlogged. This is this different for me. You're being vlogged. Yeah, I'm being vlogged. I don't like this. It's just scary. No, I like to head behind the camera. Oh, Jesus. So it is currently 9 p.m. and we just wrapped up the event. It was awesome. Got to meet a bunch of bunch of dope people. Connect with a bunch of great people. And now I'm going back to the office to um, upload this footage so my editors can edit it. And it is, again, 9 p.m. Started the day at around 5, so it just shows um, the grind is real. And But that's that's the main point of these vlogs. I want to keep a daily, daily diary and daily documentation of what it's like building an actual company and the work that goes into it. It, it does take from 5 a.m. to 10 p.m. some nights. More often than not, most nights. Um, so that's that's what goes into building an actual business and I want to show that and show the behind the scenes and how it's it's not glamorous building a business. If you build a business because you want freedom, you want more money, you want X, Y, and Z, you want such a fancy lifestyle, entrepreneurship is not for you. And I, I know it sounds cliche and I know so many people say it, but that's that's the truth. It takes the 16, 17 hour work days that you just need to work harder than the next person. And sometimes that's what it takes. Too many people go into it for the wrong reasons and just don't work for it. They just don't, they don't execute. And I'm sick of it. I wanna, I wanna make impact and I wanna literally impact 
millions of people across the globe and I want to be one of the top entrepreneurs in the world. That is my goal. I want I want to build a university. I want to build a college. I want to build a school. Like I want to make just crazy impact on the world. But that that's a lot of money, which that's a whole nother that's a whole nother conversation to have on how people are so um, cynical about making a lot of money. Money is not bad, money is opportunity. So I'm just working for more opportunity and that's why I'm so motivated. I want to build a billion dollar business so I can have more change, so I can implement more change to the world, so I can change millions of people's lives individually. And without money, you can't do any of that. So that is the reason why I'm doing all of this. I want to I want to inspire. I want to change. I want to literally leave the world in a better place than when I got here. And that's the whole reason why I'm building these companies. And it's everything is just little increments and little stepping stones to building my grand vision and just building a life I want to live. And I again I want to inspire thousands and thousands of millions of people but it starts with storytelling and sharing your story and documenting and creating something worth creating and creating something worth living for and doing something that no one else is creating and that's what I'm going that's what I'm trying to do that's what I am doing I'm just in, I'm just inspired I'm fired up and I I, I love life um, I won't cut any of this because I just want to want you guys to know how authentic it is, but I'm just inspired. I met a lot of great people tonight and I had a lot of great conversations again. Um, but yeah, I am sorry. I'm, I'm vlogging and uh, people were just passing here, but yeah, met a lot of, lot of amazing people. So many big changes happening. Um, and I couldn't be more excited to share with you guys and take you guys on this journey. So again, um, that's what I got. I'll I'll wrap this up at the office, but that's where I'm going right now. Again, 9:09, uh, 9:09 p.m. So I am back in the office again. It is 9:30, um, but I need to upload all of this footage I am shooting right now to my editing team. Um, I have a team based out of the Philippines, actually. It's a whole team, and they're handling all of my editing, so I can really push push a lot of content out um, with these with these videos. So I love working with them. It's a company called Video Husky. They do unlimited video editing for like five to 700 bucks a month. So um, paying about 600 bucks a month for that. But just in general, people are afraid to work. People are afraid to put their heads down and actually make a life for themselves. I've met a lot of great entrepreneurs and great people but that have fallen off or that aren't to the point where they want to be yet, which is amazing, but they lack one, th one main thing and that's consistency and drive. Like they don't know why they're doing it and they, just, they want it for the, for the wrong reasons. Um, but entrepreneurship is a, is a game and it's a hard game. It's a very, very hard game. Um, so if, if you're in it for the money, for the fame, I talked about this um, earlier, but you're in it for the wrong reasons. It takes a lot, a lot of work. So again, started the day at uh, 5 a.m. Uh, and now it's coming up about 10 p.m. I don't even know how many hours that is. Um, 12, five, it's five, five, six, seven, 17, 18 hours. It, it takes work. Um, Yesterday was a 16 hour day. Today's a 17 to 18 hour day. Um, and I, I just wanna show you guys that I wanna document that from day one, what it's like starting a company, what it's like creating content, what it's like pushing out an enormous amount of content per day, which is what I'm hoping to do with these. Um, so again, that's, that's what I'm doing. I'm gonna end the vlog here. And this was day two of daily documentation. Just me sharing the stories on how I'm building an actual company from day one. So again, day two, it is August 20th, 2019. I'll catch you guys on the next video. But again, if you like what you see, please make sure to subscribe, leave a comment down below. Always hit me up. I'm on all social media platforms. So find me there at Sam Lister. Um, really looking forward to connecting with you guys more. and. I just really hope any of this brings brings value to, to any of you out there. So again, let me know. Uh, just hit me back. And thank you guys again for watching. And until next time, 
keep killing it and keep hustling.